Alright, you guys, welcome back to another Xenoverse 2 Modded Showcase video, and today we're gonna become extremely overpowered because we're gonna be using real sand transformation multipliers. A huge shout out to JT Hamill for creating the Super Saiyan All with anime multipliers. So, as you guys know, in the normal Xenoverse 2 base game, when we transform into a Super Saiyan, we get a times 1.10 power boost. As for Super Saiyan 2, it's a times 1.15, and Super Saiyan 3, I believe, is times 1.20 power boost. Well, since we're going off the anime, when we transform into a Super Saiyan, we're going to be getting a times 50 power boost. As for Super Saiyan 2, times 100, and Super Saiyan 3, times 400. And we're just going to be one-shotting our opponents out here. I do want to take this new transformation into some of the difficult parallel quest missions that I do. But once we get to the Ultra Instinct Master State, our power is being multiplied by 100 million, which is just absolutely insane. So we're just going to hop straight into photo mode to showcase the power behind the anime multipliers. Make sure to leave a like on today's video, I will greatly appreciate it. I did raise Goku's health bar to the max, so right now he's sitting at the raid boss pink health, and this is how much damage we do in our base form. We barely do any damage at all with a single jab, right? <laughs> so this is how much damage we do with a triangle hit. Oh, yeah, it's actually about the same as the square combo, right? And this is how much we do with a key blast. Uh, literally, like, no damage at all. So, we're gonna get to the points where we can actually one-shot Goku over here with a single jab. Here I come! Let's go! I'm ready for this. Alright, I'm actually excited for this as well. Okay, let's see how much damage we do now with a single jab. Look, my health bar increasing as well. Okay, so our health also increases by 50. That's actually kind of cool. Alright, so for the single jab, let's see how much damage we do. Okay. <laughs> Yo, how much was that? Wait, is that like, I think that was like two and a quarter health bar, right? Yeah, so that's definitely two health bars and a little bit extra damage. Let's just say two and a quarter, okay? As for the triangle hits, we almost do three whole health bars. All right, <laughs> kind of nice. Okay, we hardly do any damage at all. I also want to get to the point where we can one-shot Goku over here with a single key blast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's gonna be quite insane. All right, so wait, let's see if we can kill him with a normal combo. Oh, we definitely can. Yo, my man just got <laughs> one shot in with the combo. Oh, all right, all right. So wait, I actually wanna see how much damage we do with the series of key blasts. Of course, we have to wait for his health. Hurry up, health. Oh, so we do immense damage, of course. I think that was only like two health bars. All right, let's just go straight into Super Saiyan 2. So since Super Saiyan is a 50 times multiplier and we did about two and a quarter, now we're in Super Saiyan 2, which is times 100. Uh, I'm guessing we're gonna do about four and a half. Okay, so that's the half. That's the one health bar. Two health bars, three health bars, and four health bars. Yo, this thing is accurate, man. <laughs> so we do about four and a half. Maybe it's more like four and a quarter this time around. But <laughs> let's see how much damage we do with the normal triangle. Okay, this one, uh, I believe we do about like five and a half damage, right? Or five and a half health bars. As for the key blast damage. Okay, now we're doing around a quarter health. <laughs> Maybe, we're, we're getting close. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, I'm pretty sure he will die if we just do a few square combo hits, right? There it is! <laughs> Only three combo hits, man. Come on, Goku, you need to train over here. Alright, Super Saiyan 3. So again, since Super Saiyan 2 was a times 100 multiplier, and we did about uh, four and a half d uh, health damage, and this is times 400, so we're gonna be doing around 16 health damage. You know, 16 bar damage, whatever you wanna call it. So that means 
in theory, he should die with just this single blow, right? Ah, oh, it's true! <laughs> Hey, yo, I love how the uh, multipliers just keep on adding up. So, Super Saiyan 3 with the times 400 multiplier one shots a max power character in Xenoverse 2, which is quite crazy. Alright, so now let's see how much damage a Key Blast does. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure that this won't kill him. Yeah, so that only does about one health damage, right? Okay, now let's move up to Super Saiyan God. I believe it was a 40,000 multiplier. <laughs> Let's go! Oh my gosh! Alright, so Super Saiyan God can one shot a full power raid boss with a single key blast, which is just absolutely insane. Oh, we're definitely a lot faster. Oh, yes! <laughs> Alright, hold on, hold on. We're just gonna go straight into Super Saiyan Blue. Obviously, we're not going to test out the damage because Super Saiyan God Goku can, or Super Saiyan God Transformation can one-shot uh, a full-power raid boss. Here it is, Ultra Instinct. Let's see how fast we move. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. What is this? This isn't even Master Ultra Instinct. Alright, so this is the times 100 million multiplier, right? So we're just moving. Moving in our normal speed. We're not even dashing just yet. And we're now we're dashing. <laughs> what is this? Okay, this is so fast. Alright, now let's just go straight into the parallel quest. This is the parallel quest that we're going to be doing with the transformation multipliers. It's called Eternal Rival Limit Breaker. Shoutouts to Project Wolf for creating this. This is actually just an edited version of the Ultimate Rivalry. As you can see, we have to fight Goku and Vegeta still, but of course, since this is, you know, a difficult parallel quest, uh, they're gonna start off with max health, and with each form we defeat, they're gonna come back much stronger. <laughs> oh, they already just spawned in. I thought we were gonna have to wait for them to fly in. Alright, so I did pick two Salamans just because, you know, I'm gonna do this by myself, technically, right? So, I guess we'll just match their strength. When they transform into a Super Saiyan, we'll go ahead and transform into our Super Saiyan form. <laughs> so right now, <laughs> I got two top men jumping Vegeta. <gasps> oh, you come on, Vegeta, we put a block though. You should know this. Ah, oh, step back, what are you trying to do? Okay, I'm gonna need a transform out here. <laughs> I'm literally about to die. I can use capsules. Of course I can use capsules in my base form, but once I go into my Super Saiyan form, I won't need it because obviously my health will also get that times 50 power boost as well. Let's go, Vegeta! Possible. Ah, oh, why do we have to miss the last three though? Okay, he's literally almost dead. We're so close. Come on! Ah, he snapped! <laughs> Oh, I, he transformed. Okay. <laughs> Let's just go into our first tr transformation state. Why not? Let's go. 50 times multiplier. Let's take out Goku first, though. Let's see how fast his health drains. You're pretty good. Oh, wow. Literally two punches, and we made him transform into Kyle. <laughs> okay, now it's straight to uh, Super Saiyan. <laughs> Look at his health. He's literally already almost dead. Okay, we need a limit burst out here with my auto health. Oh! Damn it! I'm at my limit. How could you? Yo, this transformation is too easy. It makes the difficult parallel quest way too easy. Look at that! Wasn't a Super Saiyan supposed to be almighty? All right, Super Saiyan the three Goku. Should I transform into my Super Saiyan three state? Nah, I don't think so. To be honest. I think I'm just gonna stay in my Super Saiyan form. <laughs> I don't need my times 400 power boost. Nah, we staying in our Super Saiyan form. Look at, oh my gosh! I can literally do any difficult parallel quest mission now. Of course, when I play the difficult missions for real, 
I won't be using this uh, transformation. Hey, maybe I will though, if I can find, you know, a very difficult parallel quest where the other characters also get, you know, a multiplier, then I'll use this transformation. <laughs> but we have Super Saiyan! God, Vegeta, and Goku? Okay! Oh no, he's literally gonna die right here. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's not taking any more damage. <laughs> Your turn, Goku. What's next? Super Saiyan Blue. Yep. Alright, let's do our best. No cheating, okay? I don't really want to go to my <laughs> God forms, because I just, you know, literally one-shot them with a single jab. Okay, actually, I think I might have to. It's taking a little bit longer. Look at my health. I'm not even taking any damage as well. Oh. Now I've done it. I don't care. We'll just hold all those. Come on, Vegeta. Oh, we got to finish. Okay. Ooh, new cutscene? You're serious business, pal. I think it's time to strategize. I told you not to give me orders. What hairbrain scheme do you have this time? Come on. I'm gonna hey, hit you with everything. All right, all right. Should I transform <laughs> into my god state now? Wait, let's see how fast he dies first. Not bad. Not bad at all. Ah, okay, so he's dead. He started off with pink raid boss health as well, too. This is it. My final ace in the hole. What is it? Vegito? He's gonna defuse from Gogeta and transform into Vegito. Oh, I guess I was right. All right, let's just go into Super Saiyan Blue. Saiyan Survivor. Let's go. We cancel those out, Vegito. Watch this. <laughs> One elbow and he died. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're just gonna stay in our Super Saiyan Blue form. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the last fight. Look at Blue Evolve Vegeta's aura. I really do like that. UI Goku, get off of me now. We're gonna save you for last, to be honest. We need to take out Vegeta first. I'm not going to survive this. Ah. <laughs> One single blow. How should I finish off Goku over here? Evasive! Oh, can evasive? What? Oh, I can! <laughs> Yo, a single evasive can one shot Ultra Instinct Goku. Look at this. Alright, so this is it for today's video. Just fooling around with the anime sand multipliers. Of course, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like on today's video. I'll greatly appreciate it. And I have all model links down below in the description, of course, if you guys do want these mods for yourself and if you guys do mod on PC. Thank you guys for the immense support, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!